No Film School's coverage of NAB is brought to you by Shutterstock, where ideas take shape. Black Magic Design, amazing solutions for film, post-production, and television. Big Stock, videos and images for everyone. Color Grading Central, professional color grading with color finale. All right, we're here with uh, Jeremy, CEO of Atmos. Yes or sometimes Atomos, depending on where you are. Uh, so you've got some new features for the 4K yes. Shogun. Uh, what's new here? Okay, so we've got uh, anamorphic D-Squeeze. So that's been a big one, big request from um, you know independent cinema guys who are using anamorphic lenses. Plus, Panasonic GH4 has just, just come out with a 4x3 video output from their sensor, which you'll need a, and with an anamorphic lens on, so that then you can de-squeeze it. So we support that and the normal 2x, 1.5 and, and 1.3x. Um, big announcements, I think, are pre-roll, where we're caching recording prior to hitting record. So that it's coming from your camera, you hit record on your camera. You miss something. You miss you something. Got. I used to love that on DV cameras when I was first in the industry, and they, that kind of went away. Mm. So we've whacked that in. Yeah. Uh, we've got time lapse video, which honestly I think is really big. When I first used it, I'm like, oh yeah, whatever. And then I saw the results. Mm -hmm. So you can say, I want to record 10 frames for three minutes mm -hmm. over an hour. And you can do single frame for. Yep, you can do single frame, you can do multiple frames, you can do bursts. And actually, I'm not you know, th that creative a guy. I like making electronic equipment. But um, when I did it, I was like, wow, that, that's pretty good. Yeah. You know, it really, uh, anyway, I think customers will really enjoy, enjoy that. We've got custom metadata tagging for all the cut editing that we do on the device. Mm -hmm. So you can put in audio pop, color correct this, and you can tag footage. We also right. have playlist play out, which is all your playlists, you can choose which ones to play out and check a compilation of your recordings okay. on the fly to a big screen TV while you've got everyone there or at the event. Right, so you could just show people your, your good takes exactly. on the screen. And if you cut edit inside those takes, they will also play back. It's like dailies in your monitor. Exactly. And so it's like a play out server, I guess, yeah. is uh, how we're kind of putting it. So th yeah, big announcements for, we've also got RAW for ARRI, the AJ Scion, okay. for Canon cameras and for the FS series cameras. Okay, and, and let's back up a little bit for someone who doesn't know the uh, old features, much yes, less the yeah, new features. Oh, that's so that's the, what the happens price point, Yeah, exactly. Uh, and the recorder and the price point, you know, just uh, what can this do? What does it record to? Okay, so it's a combination, and our philosophy is reduce the number of devices on set, give better quality, make it a faster production so you can produce either a more creative result or make more profit by doing more productions. Mm -hmm. Whichever kind of bent you're on, yeah. we're trying to fulfill that. So we've packed in a recorder, a monitor, a playback deck and an edit device, all in one. So, recording, you go to ProRes 4K in HQ 422 or LT, you, you go to DNxHR, we're the only ones in the world doing that externally on a recorder, mm -hmm. DNxHR to um, four, four different flavours, you know, HQX, HQ, all their different flavours. Then we've got Cinema DNG raw recording, okay. which is coming uh, in beginning of June. Okay. And that allows you to go from these raw formats that we're now implementing from the cameras I just mentioned, so that you can then wrap it in Cinema DNG. Right. But from the raw, we, we can go directly to ProRes or DNX. So you can go from raw to video on the cameras that don't you, output you convert 4K it, video. The, the Shogun converts it. The Shogun converts it internally. We think that's important because 90% yeah. of people are still using ProRes and DNX for shooting. That top 10% who are, or you know, for a portion of their production are using raw, mm -hmm. They can turn on the raw for that, for the bits that they want to push colors and you know color correct and do all those wonderful things that you can do with raw. Mm -hmm. um, but for most of the shots that you've lit correctly or are outside, mm -hmm. then you just use ProRes or DNX from that raw output. So that, we think that's a, a pretty pretty big feature. And the media it records to? So media that records to is um, standard SSDs, 2.5 inch. You can go and buy them at you know, Fry's or Best Buy, mm -hmm. or you can go and buy them at B&H, wherever you want to buy them. Um, we heavily test and the the disc that we support. So it's like us doing our own disc, okay. but we you have, a, you have a recommended we list. have a recommended list, which means you can source it locally because we actually go deep and wide. You don't sell that many recorders without having a really strong global presence. And so we go into like the corners of Africa and right into the Middle East and Russia and those places. Not the same drives are available there. So we we get those drives in from customers who say that I'd like you to support this drive. 
and we end up supporting that and then they can buy it locally. So that's our strategy. Yeah. We're open on the cameras, we're open on the drives, but we're very closed on quality of the unit. Absolutely. Nothing worse than not recording. No. Uh, okay, so, and, and obviously we can also back up and talk about this is the high-end unit. Yes. Um, you start, what's the, the least expensive one? Is 295, the Ninja Star, yeah. which is for you know drones and um, GoPros and things like that, or really light uh, portable rigs. So it weighs, you know, I think it's like 12 ounces or 11 ounces or something like that. Are all of your monitors recorders now? Yes, all, all of our monitors yeah. are recorded. That's just a recorder. The yeah. monitor recorder started at Ninja 2, which really right. made us famous oh, with yeah, yeah. 5D Mark III yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and D800 right. and then all the video cameras. You know, Rec Play wanted to edit the big buttons on the, on the mm -hmm. user interface. Mm -hmm. So those have um, sold exceptionally well. Yeah. And actually, we've got some um, pretty cool news for everybody on right. the Ninja Blade, Samurai Blade, and the Ninja 2. We've actually I had a lot of people with, uh, we've got these 90,000 users, right? And they've all got batteries and accessories because I give it every time in the box. And they said, Jeremy, this is fantastic, but I've got hundreds of these things. You don't want to buy it again. I don't want to buy it again thing. and have the same thing. So I, I just want to take X amount of batteries with me and use, use the product that I'm, that I'm trying to use with whatever camera I'm, I'm on. So we've removed the, um, all the accessories, and now we've got all bare bones lineup, mm -hmm. which is just, and it pains me to say it because I, I, I hated receiving a camera that didn't have a battery in it, right? right. But it's just the recorder with an AC adapter, 1695 for Shogun, so that receives it as well. Okay. 795 for Ninja and Samurai Blade, and they were 995. And then we've got 395 for the Ninja 2. So that, yes. that is a killer for HD cameras that haven't found ProRes yet, that haven't realized the benefits of the operating system and the workflow, but more and more people are discovering that and we're we're stoked that so many people are coming on board. Absolutely. So this is um, the new features for this are a firmware update, or how does that work? Yeah, firmware update, free firmware update. So the the initial features I mentioned will be coming out in May, and then then in June. So two updates. We got six point three, and then six point four and five will be about the same time. Great. Thanks so much. Thanks, guys. Love no film school, man. Thank you. Awesome. Glad to hear. Keep it. up the good work. You too.